This man, Leo Ackley, is going to trial in the killing of his girlfriend's three-year-old daughter. Little Bailey Stenman died from blunt force trauma to the head back in August. Ackley claims he found the child unresponsive on the floor of a bedroom. 24 Hour News 8's Ann Schieber was in the Calhoun County Courthouse where Ackley was sent to trial during a preliminary exam today. Maybe seated. Ackley was bound over on charges of open murder and first degree child abuse. The judge ordered him held without bond. It took two days of full testimony ending after the medical examiner took the stand. She said there was no way the injuries occurred from a fall. Ackley was watching Bailey and her sister while their mother returned to work after coming home briefly for lunch. He brought the unresponsive child to his mother's house and his sister determined the child needed to be brought to the hospital. The medical examiner testified that in addition to the head trauma, Bailey had a number of bruises. It's in and of themselves, each injury may not seem significant. Uh, but bruises in these areas are uh, are concerning and are generally considered a red flag for um, non-accidental type injuries. One of the detectives on the case testified that Ackley said he was frustrated by Bailey's difficulty with toilet training and she frequently wet herself and her bed. Ackley's attorney argued that the prosecutor failed to prove intent, which is necessary for charges of open murder and first degree child abuse. But the judge did not agree. He said, based on the medical examiner's report, he said it's pretty clear this kind of fatal injury was intentional. In Battle Creek, Ann Schieber, 24 Hour News 8.